fucking do it. Don't you fucking do it. It, it ain't going down like this. Fucking loose. Motherfucker. What is the crack, ladies and gentlemen? It's Gibbo Air here with another episode of World of Warcraft in the Chronos 2 server. Hey, how you doing? Oh, God, that, that hurts the insides every time I do it now. That's that's bad. Oh, God. Right, still sick. Day, day five of being sick now, I think we're at. Day five. Yeah, about day five now. It fucking sucks either way. Um, I'm still in a pretty bad way. Uh, cough bottle is definitely, or cough bottle, not cough bottle, the fucking, what do you call this shit? Exputex. Liquefies viscous mucus. That's the words he's all wanted to hear. You know, that's it, let's log on to YouTube and fucking, let's watch an episode of Gibbo Air. That puts us in a good mood. Viscous mucus. I think I'll go have my dinner now. Um, <laughs> yeah, no, I, I'm still pretty bad. Um, it, it's improving. But I've been coughing so much that it's actually gotten to the point where the abs are sore from coughing. And it's just like, you know, you've got muscle soreness from the gym. Ow. And then you've got abdominal soreness from coughing. Oh, no, it's not really. It's like kind of upper abs, kind of lower chest. It's kind of, you know, diaphragm. We'll go with that. We'll go with that. You may be wondering why I'm killing animals. We are doing the encoded fragments right here. Yeah. yeah. So we need to kill an absolute fucking shit ton of these guys uh, for this quest. Because the drop rate initially seemed quite decent. It ain't so good anymore. I'm out of range. Uh, we're getting a lot of skins, though. Like, I'm, I'm primarily focusing on beasts like skin. Uh, logic being, of course, you know, why the fuck not? We're going to need to get fucking skins eventually anyway, so it makes sense. There is a group going for Maradon. Um... However, the unfortunate issue with that is it is looking for a healer and not a gibbo error. So that's created an issue. They're still looking for that healer. Ditch, one of you guys just fucking bail and let me go. And then you won't need a healer because your DPS will be so fucking high that you won't have time to take damage because I'm a fucking god. Yeah, that's that's my logic. That's that's my answer, and we're gonna stick with it. And you guys aren't gonna question it, are you? No, didn't think so. They didn't fucking think so. Uh, I'm sorry I didn't make a video yet. Uh, a video yet, yo. I'm sorry I didn't make a video yesterday. Uh, I was I playing Arma with the lads, and we got into a wee bit of a, a clan war, so to speak, on the server. So the next biggest clan uh, had a bit of an engagement with ourselves. So it kind of involved a bit of a siege. Sunken Temple, I would prefer to get this quest done. Jesus, the fucking severe lack of a drop rate is uh is starting to grind my gears. But yeah, no, we, there was a bit of a siege of our base yesterday, and there was an engagement, and all sorts of stuff kicked off. So that ate up a lot of my time. That and I've, I've started playing Mountain Blade again. So uh, that's also eating up some of my time. But anyway, that, that's where I happened to yesterday, so I was online, I just wasn't playing WoW. Well, because shit was happening. People were trying to blow up our fucking base. They were fucking setting bombs on the door, and blowing shit up. We were throwing grenades out at them. It was fucking awesome. It was good crack. Thoroughly enjoyable. Again, any of you guys that don't play Arma, anyone that has been convinced to play Arma in my circle of friends fucking loves it. Um, and I'm quite glad I got convinced to fucking play it. It's a sick fucking game. Would highly recommend the game itself, the base game, like in terms of like the campaign and the, like the King of the Hill game and stuff like that online, um, is fun. It's extremely fun. But the the golden kind of part of it is the, uh, the mods that the community has created. So the likes of like the Exile mod, which we play Epoch or Breaking Point or any of those things. Um, fucking sick uh, and you will get hours and hours out of this entertainment and it goes on sale on fucking steam so frequently you can get it for 50 percent off which will work out as something like 40 quid for all of the expansions which you want by the way you want the whole lot so would recommend that if you do see that shit on sale on steam uh if you're into like military simulation games if you like fucking i don't know like project reality or squad or anything like that you should enjoy arma yeah, you most definitely will enjoy Herman. So, uh, would recommend. Then Mountain Blade was the other thing that was bleeding in my time. If any of you guys have played that, I thought about doing like a series of Mountain Blade as well. Mountain Blade is a kind of like you make up your own fucking story as you go along. 
I'm playing the Viking Reforged Edition, which is the kind of like most polished version of it now that's currently out. And uh, it's fucking sick. It's so fucking good. But watch me call it. Um, you can be an Irishman in it. You, know I mean? you gotta make up your own story. You set your own backstory to how you got to where you are. And then you just you play through a world and you just go at it. I don't know. I think it'd be really fun to do a fucking playthrough in it because of the fact that oh shit, I'm gonna have to pop a pot. Ah, oh, that was a fucking pain in the ass, dude. As you can see, the drop rate in this quest is fucking atrocious. It's, how many things have I killed and I've gotten two of them? Um. I, I, I did a tester. I, I killed a few things because I wanted to see if I was doing the quest right. These guys have dropped it. I think it's just going to be a random drop. We either get a look here or we don't. I might have been on board like a shoe actually again. Now that I, I look at it. Oh dear. No, I think we're good. I think we should. Oh no, that, that definitely made things a bit more spicy. That's. Oh, oh right down to the wire. We need another Simpson strike or something. Yeah, no, we're good. Yeah, never doubted it for a second that we were going to fucking take that shit out. But anyway, I'm still sick as a fucking dog. Um, I'm going to go to the gym after this. I'm going to see how I get on. I, I haven't got high expectations for what's going to fucking happen. I took a rest day yesterday because I was in fucking bits. But we'll go back at it tomorrow. Or sorry, today. And we'll see how it goes. It should be fine. It should be okay. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm out and played. Like, um, I'm playing the Viking Reforged Edition. And even for a game that's so fucking old, well, I suppose Viking Reforged was what, like, it's just oh, right. Right. Oh, Shit, I we need to mooch a bit off here. Um, I think it was 2012, but like for a game that came out like so many years ago, like, Mountain Blade Warbands kind of beyond so, like, it's still a fucking astoundingly fun game to play. Uh, and it's so fucking cheap on Steam as well. Again, another game that I would recommend that you guys pick up. But anyway, get the Viking Reforged one, and you can, it's basically like European Dark Age history. And it's, it's not really history, like, it's fucking... It, like, there's historically accurate details in it, like tribes and stuff that would have been in Ireland and in France and Norway and shit. Other than that, like, it, it's kind of, you, you make it what you want to make it, like, and there's a story in it that you can follow if you want, or you can set it to be, like, an open sandbox. Originally, I did follow the story, which was good crack. I haven't actually finished the story, because when I reset my computer, I lost all my data. But, fucking... Let me snake up behind this guy, and we get him. I, I think we should probably focus on things like this, because they drop meat and stuff that we're going to to sell. But anyway, um... I, I was kind of against doing the sandbox mode, because I didn't think we actually have one. But I'm actually doing a new sandbox mode now at the moment. Started off in the middle of Ireland. I'm now involved in a massive tribal war, which is fucking sick. <laughs> it's so much fun. Um, would recommend that game, too. Anyone's looking for something to fucking kill a few hours over the next couple of weeks. Go look up Mountain Blade, dude. It's a sick fucking game. And there's a new one on the way. Bannerlord. Uh, fucking... Joe was the one that actually put me on the armor and Mountain Blade. Uh, he recommended that shit. But fucking... He's the one that's been piping all this information to me about <coughs> Bannerlord coming down the line. Which apparently it's been coming down the line for yonks. So like it's... It's quite overdue at this stage. But, um, that looks like a sick fucking game. With a few clips of gameplay that I've seen, like, it looks like something I'm gonna sink a lot of errors in. But because of the... No, we're not gonna use a pot. We don't need one. I don't need one. Yeah, bitch. So I roll. And um, because of the fact that it's kind of like a you make your own story and shit like that, I think it'd be fun to do a let's play fucking series in it. I don't know. I watched Splattercat do on on fucking Warband. I think it was. It's one of his older fucking series, but fucking oh, it's sick. It's so fucking good. Um, and the Reforged Edition is quite polished, so fucking... Like, it actually might be fun to watch a Let's Play of it. Like, a kind of Iron Man, kind of, like, don't save things before you... It's all about decision-making and RNG and fucking... There's lots of things that feature in it, but I don't know. I, I think it could be fun. I think it could be extremely fun. So I, I'd consider possibly resetting... Or not, maybe not reset. I'd have to reset myself, because I couldn't run two at the same time. I, I don't have the attention span of that. <laughs> Hope we could possibly do a fucking a let's play on that. That'd be a crack. I don't know. To relive my my Viking tribal fantasy from, you know, centuries ago. No, we got another one! Yeah, that's what I wanted. That's what I wanted to show. 
Okay. I think I've talked shit enough now for the first 10 minutes. So, what I reckon is I'm gonna pause this shit here, because as you can see, the drop rate on this crap is absolutely fucking atrocious. I'm at this about 18 minutes now. Pretty much 18 minutes because of the, uh, the poisons, let me know. And um, so what my plan is, I'm gonna sit here for the next oh, century and a half, drink my fucking tea, finish this quest off, and when I get this shit done, I'll come back and we will fucking figure out some other shit to do. We'll, no, we'll, we'll follow this quest on and see what else we get out of it. And uh, hopefully we get that sunken temple fucking quest by the end of this day. And if we do, I have like no food on me. So I might just like AFK heal for a minute while I go fucking get... Do I need more tea? No, I don't. I have a massive mug. Disneyland mug. Is all good. Tasty. But what I might do is I might AFK heal here for a bit because I don't want to keep... Ah, well, fuck it. Whatever. We'll just use them. That's all G. But, um... It's going to take me a long while to farm through this shit. So I'm going to have to pause it. <laughs> Uh, when I come back, we should have it just about done, or be finishing it. And then from there, we'll go hand this back in. And then, not too sure what we're going to be doing towards the end. Maybe we'll get us some contemporary proof and actually get this shit done. Who knows? Anyway, I'll be back in a moment. Er, blah. He doesn't look like he's having a fun time. We're on our second round of poisons here. Killing moss hair. Moss hoof, of course. You get... Stag meat, as well as leather. You don't appear to be dropping. We got one more and go to Dragment in the interim. Yeah, that's DC. That's exactly what I need right now. Uh, yeah, the drop rate in this is hella low. Be nice if I had a quest or two here that I could be doing while I was doing this, but this is just. Ugh. Look at how much experience I've ground out since like the last time. It's fucking crazy. Okay. I'm not too sure if these fucking deer dropped them. But I, I've definitely gotten them off these fuckers, so we may switch back over. See if that improves our look. <gasps> okay. Oh, look, the Mara group are starting to have a bit of a, a moment of crisis. Maybe if you just weren't looking for a healer, you could totally, you know, fucking take me along. You know, I could heal. There's another guy. Must be for some fucking quest or some shit like that. Trolls getting fucking turned into crystals. Mm, next time you look at you your diamond ring, you're fucking wet. What the fuck? Let's go talk to this dude. You there. Quickly. Give me a buff or something. You seek the scepter shard, charge the protection of the blue dragonfly. Appears to be smiling. Was this before, you know, Wrath of the Lich King, where you go nuts? Start doing the crazy shit. Yeah, it must be. Feels bad, bro. Oh, shit. Well, oh, that could have went smoother. Anyway, I'll be back in a moment once I fucking, you know, kill another 130 animals for the sake of finding a couple of quest items. Quickly! No! Oh, so close! Damn, I need more food with me. Drop one. Back in a bit. Bad news, our bags are full, so we need to make our way back to vendor some grey shit real fast because we picked up so fucking much. Um, so I'm gonna make my way back to the bowyer. Uh, back to the lower level mobs as well because fuck these guys. And I'm trying to acquire some food somewhere along the way. Make life a wee bit easier. Look at these. Taking this motherfucker on? Let's see how they get on here. Oh, I don't know. Oh, well, the druid can heal, I suppose. But the druid's going ham there on that. Anyway. Tune in next week to find out how that ends. Anyway, I'm gonna go back and fucking sell some shit and clear out some bag space. If needs be, I'll fly to, like, Darnassus or something like that and fucking auction house some shit or whatever it needs to happen. But stuff needs to happen anyway. Oh, I got another one. <laughs> oh, there's a Mara run. Could it be the fucking Mara dream? The princess run? Is it happening? I think it is. And I'm nearly at the flight path as well. I need a break from killing these fucking monsters. Like, I'm fucking... I think I ground out about 20 grand in experience. Uh, just from killing mobs. Uh, I'm pretty fucking tired of these fuckers and their shit, so... Yeah. Mm. 
let's go do something else. Right, so this is going to end up being a, a Maradon episode. Featuring half of a rogue quest. Uh, I'm going to go sneeze my brains out off camera. That was fucking delightful, man. Uh, we are going to go vendor some fucking grey shit to clear out some bag space. Fly over to... Where's Maradon? Where is Maradon? That's in the Desolus. I remember. I remember. Um, yeah, no, fucking, we're gonna go fly to the Desolus then. We'll pick up food while we're there because we're intelligent like that. And I haven't used a hundred bleeding room cloth bandages. Um, yeah, no, we'll pick up some fucking room cloth when we get there. And then fucking, or, or sorry, yeah, food when we get there as well. Vendor all this grey shit out of my bag. There's fucking tons of it. And we got so much fucking leather from doing all that too. Like, that's... Like, there's there's all good things after happening there. Anyway, I'm going to vendor up and I'm going to fly there now, so we'll be there really fast. So I'm going to be herbal. These guys are making Warhammer jokes. Because Space Wolves and for the Emperor, and it's, it makes me feel all fuzzy inside. I'm going to quickly lockpick this and then we're going to make our way up to the Desolus. Uh, I killed a few more mobs because they were doing an escort quest, so I said, fucking why not? We'll max out our time. And we got Essence of Pain and Flash Powder. Nice. What can I make of Essence of Pain? Essence of Pain is for Crippling Poison. Well, do you know what? In, in another life, that actually would have been useful. But do you know what? We'll hang out to it for the time being. Right, we're going to fly to the Desolus now. So that way we don't miss out on this group. We've cleared up as many slots as we can. Uh, and we need to get a moving. Otherwise, we'll miss out on our opportunity for a princess run here so we can get stuff done. i seen that group trying to be made for so fucking long, and then i seen another guy advertising for it, and then within seconds, there was a group made. Like, it's just ridiculous how these things work. Oh, God. Stretch. Now, okay, I'm going to go get another cup of coffee. Um, This episode is going to be ever so slightly long now. It's going to be a Mara run mixed in with a fucking bit of leveling. But, yeah, what can you do? Again... As per usual, whenever I do a first run through of a dungeon, I'm going to show the whole entire shebang. None of it will be cut. You know, the usual crap. But then in the future, if we ever do come back to this dungeon, it'll all be highlight reel as opposed to the, the full run. Anyway, I'm going to pause this here while we fly to the desk. Listen, I'm going to go get a cup of tea. So I'll be back in a minute. Anyway, things I've learned so far about Mara. Um, it's been a century since I've fucking been here. Shit is hard to get to. <laughs> it's very... It's very far into these caverns. Uh, we're going to do a wee bit of a quest here for one of these guys. I don't know exactly what it is, but once we get that hammered out, we're going to proceed in, and then we will go from there. Anyway, while I'm waiting for this to get sorted, I will be back in a moment. Hey, fuck, I just realized we've been demoted to private. Mm, maybe it's time for another PvP video. Great success. We're all here. All right, look at this shit. Let's go. Portal in a Maradon. Zip. In we fucking go. Great fucking success at last we're in this caverny fucking place with all the waterfalls and shit and isn't this fucking beautiful let's go kill some shit quickly equip some potions potions some poisons we are going to get our trash blade ladies and gentlemen it's happening today mm. give me them buffs let's do this thing hype look at me I'm so buff Buffed. So what have we got? We've got a we've got another rogue, so that's two fucking rogues. We have a priest healing, a druid who may be tanking, and a hunter with DPS. Okay. The one DPS on Princess 2 since only one range DPS. Oh, okay, right. Righty up. This should be an interesting run. I reckon this will be fun. This group seems competent. I don't know, I get that vibe. Let's let's see. Just the microphone so it's not like in my fucking face. It's a dr What happened there? Uh, it's a druid tank. So rage, so let's avoid the stones. Um not too sure what fucking hit me that time. I'm gonna keep away from the tail, because I have a feeling that might have been one fucking done for us there. So, uh, we'll avoid that in the future. No, okay. Yeah, is that shit skill? I'm a skinner. Let's just set the precedent. I'm a skinner, and then we'll leave the next one for a little while to see if anybody else takes it. 
And then if anybody else takes it, A. And if no one else takes it, I'm taking that. Okay, get the slice and dice up. Missed that sinister strike. There's no oh. that fucking. Ah! God damn, man, that move. The life of a ranged DPS. Getting slapped around by everything. I'm not amazed. I'm glad to hear that you're not leveling a fucking. Whatchamacallit. Mage, because they fucking suck. Let's see if anyone skins this one. Or even loots it for that matter. Yeah, I'll take all that shit, bro. And if you ain't gonna skin it, I'll fucking skin that shit. All day, every day. I'll reply to your message when I get a moment. This thing flashes, so I won't forget. See, isn't it good? It likes to remind me. Yeah, that's, that's, yeah. Okay, here we go. Dinosaur time. Mm -hmm. Subterranean Dimetrodon. That's exactly what I need in my life. I don't know which one I'm meant to go on, so I'm just gonna pop that. Fuck it, let's pop, let's just go half, right at the start. Like, fuck it, let's just go, boom. Fucking, these are low-level elites. We shouldn't have an issue fucking dealing with them. Too many hams straight off the fucking nugget. The nugget. You know what I mean? I don't know what I mean. Look at that 600 fucking crit. Yeah, pro skills, man. Oh, that one's not dead. Right? Okay, well, up we go. Quickly. Stop. Ninja. Dead. Fucking wrecked, mate. I'll skin one of them and then I'll see if somebody skins the other one. I actually think I may be the only skinner here. If that's the case, I'm going to skin the shit out of everything because, you know, money! Da -da 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 -da. Okay, we run around the fucking corner here. See what's going on. Okay, only one Diametrodon. Down pretty fast before we get up on her here. And uh, get our rod off. Get the slice of dice in. I didn't get the slice of dice in. Fuck it, I'm just gonna go for the big ass eviscerate at the end instead. Pilots. Yeah, fucking not ideal, but yeah, what can you do? Greed. Everyone greeds. It's a lockbox. Everyone greeds. It's a lock. Thank you. Oh well, fuck, what did he do there? That sucks. Right. Get our. Oh, sure. It's quickly, the druid has changed onto this one, so I'm gonna get a rupture onto this one as well, so there's a rupture on each, and then I'm gonna switch back onto that. Okay, but then I'm gonna switch back onto that. Um, get this raid's on there, boom. I don't think we'll need to fucking trap. I think we're gonna. I'm leaving this shit so someone can skin, but nobody appears to be doing so. Uh, oh, yeah, I'll, you know what? I think I'll type it. Any other skinners? You know, before I feel bad. Yep, shit. This, this that ability isn't I cheap shot at that one because fuck logic. Sometimes you guys don't understand the complex decisions that my brain makes. It's super fast, hyper velocity speeds. It's okay. One day, you'll all be good at WoW, and then you will be able to comprehend my decision making. Nobody responded, so... I'm, I'm skinning everything. Fuck it. Like, you know, free leather. Let's go. The only thing is, it means that I'm usually quite far behind where I'm supposed to be. Oh, the tank is getting hit pretty hard. Let's pop a blade flurry and try and get some DPS down. On the Shrifty. We have slice and dice, so it's, this wasn't the best combo that we've ever produced. But we should get it off nice at this rate. Oh, lovely, lovely. Good damage, good damage. Uh, lovely. Okay. No other skinners. I asked. I made the effort to do so. I think the tank is about to say some profound words here. Usually when the tank goes skill, still, that usually means it's rage typing in bent. Tank took a lot of heavy hits there. I don't know what the fuck the crack was. Think the healer was a little bit far behind. Anyone want rock boss? I think we only want the princess. I think that's the only shit that I fucking need in here. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Corruption of earth and seed. I kind of do. Okay, well, we'll fucking do it for you. Why not? Seems as we're here, bro. I think I remember. I think we can just go that way and that brings us the princess. Sure, why the fuck not? I remember this boss. This boss was fun. And this is a spiral that goes all the way up, does it not? Yeah, and then there's like a boss at the tippity top. Right? Is that a th that's a thing? I can remember things. 
Look at this guy, he's just fucking, nah, we're not pulling that up. I've decided. <laughs> we're, we're going the other way. I am fucking miles away. Come on. Oh, but at least it turned. Sweet. And, oh, it's a giant, so we can put all our bleeds on it. Because that was also pretty sweet. I need to keep up with the group. I've been miles behind every time we get into combat. I think I'm putting myself into stealth too soon. So fucking, we need to kind of chill out on that. Yeah, so you see, not stealthing now because you were phase. Why are you? It's all like kind of fucking faded there. Maybe he used fade. It's not my vocabulary. We're not going to use that move. You will not catch me using that move. That move is a waste of time. It is up to the tank that generates threat. I am not here to produce threat. I am here to create threat. You gotta do more than the fucking threat I create. That's how this works, boys. That's how this works. Yeah, fuck. Every time they feign death and they pop up dead, that shit freaks me out. It's like, oh, under the night, don't know why. Oh, yeah, because it's not actually real. Oh, dear. Right, but we pulled two. Right, that one's down. My Daka brings all the food here. Orc weapons. I understand that. Because I used to play orcs. I'm enjoying the fact that I can use all my moves in these mobs. They're not elementals. This is fucking fantastic. I fucking hate elementals. Just want to point that out. Just want to put that out there. I fucking hate elementals. They're dicks. Get this on the dead. Fucking aced it. No problem. Boom. Bought food, by the way, in case anyone didn't notice. While I was in the Desolus. Or in that that place. Shit. How are we doing on... Uh, we need to chill on the random loot. Focus more on the not-so-random loot. You know what I'm saying? Prioritize, motherfucker. I don't know what that was meant to be. I think it was meant to be... Like, Riverside. That one. That was song. I quite like that song. Catchy. And slide. Ah. <laughs> I'm looking forward to getting this Ratch Blade. You guys have talked a lot of shit about it and said it's awesome, so fucking. The extra swing sounds pretty tasty. And if the extra swing can proc our talent thing that we have for whatever, that'd be also really Email. Just like the extended slice and dice as well, the extra few seconds. You can get a bit of shit done with those extra fucking seconds. Can't wait for it. Eviscerate. Slice. We've, we've gotten a lot of experience in the last episode or so, actually. We, we've done a bit of work. The Adric Crystal Shave. That's, that's wonderful. I do love my idea. Oh wait, what am I doing? <laughs> kinda kinda went a bit ahead of myself there. Now this boss, I actually can't remember what he does. He does something. He has like a knock-up or a stun or some shit like. I don't know. It's too far away. Oh. <laughs> I don't know, I'm reading the fucking chat down below. Okay. Got beat up again. This, this guy did nothing. I, I thought he had like a stun or like a knockoff, or maybe I'm thinking of a different dungeon. He dropped this wonderful fucking item that I have no interest in taking. Would be nice to vendor it, I guess. We need to start fucking making some bank. 158 gold, 7 levels to go. Maybe I should just ninja everything in this dungeon and be like, oh no, it's for an alt, but it's buying a pickup. It's for an alt. <laughs> and then vendor everything. This could be a plan. Uh, I have a couple of ideas to make some fucking fast go. Like, go back through like low level fucking dungeons and just slump my way fucking through them and then vendor all the shit, but keep any BOEs and then sell them on the auction house. That could be another way of making some quick G's. We've done it before for the horse, like, literally for the last few fucking minutes. But vendored everything because you know <laughs> time was of the essence there's a there's a few plans there to make money we've also got a, like a copious amount of fucking leather to be able to sell. i'm reckoning that i should probably have about 400 maybe 500 by the time i get to 60. off just continuing doing what we're doing i am on the wrong target switch over there we go see i have to use up the combo points or else it, it's not worth you know what i mean like it's Otherwise, it's a fucking waste. But at the same time, you need to have a bit of kind of 
cop on in terms of your damage output because you don't want to fucking out DPS the tank and then cause hassle for the healer and the tank then to get the aggro back. I, I kicked it. I thought I got into stealth there. I wanted a cheap shot, but you know, whatever. Fine. Fun is Okay, class. Oh, well, if you guys ain't gonna take it, I'm gonna fucking skin it. I'm gonna skin all that shit, man. Look at all this money! No one else is skinning. I did ask. I just want to point that out. Before anyone was like, you skinned everything. I fucking asked. And no one responded. Which means I gave them the opportunity. I wasn't going to be a dick about it, but, you know. I think I want to fucking... I want to fucking... Get on board with the fucking pain train. Yep. I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. Okay. I think we're nearly at the princess. She's, like, down there. So we just got to kill a few of these fuckers. Oh, wow, shit. Well, AOE damage. How are you? I don't think a Shadow Priest can heal basically just fine. That's the nice thing about the other. You can kind of be outside of your class and still do shit with the jib because you still got all the fucking moves you pretty much do. Like not necessarily effectively, but for while you're level and stuff, you can kind of hammer your way up. Whereas like in retail now, you just you roll whatever specific thing you are, like tank or DPS, healer or DPS, or if you're tri-spec called three, <laughs> paladins or you know, druids. But fucking, I don't know, it, it feels like it's a bit more kind of forced. Whereas in this, you could kind of make things work. It may not have worked well, but it, it kind of worked. Hopefully this guy doesn't AOE and I'm like slow walking my ass over here. Oh yeah, no, never mind. I think we're nearly there. Pretty much these couple of fucking mobs and the princess is right down there at the end. This should be a fun fight. I can't remember Princess at all, by the way. Uh, I only took her out for one day. So I don't really, I don't really talk about it. I don't remember the fucking boss fight at all. I don't remember the encounter, and I don't remember what she does. They were talking about range DPS and shit like that there, so we don't even need to kill this guy. So, I don't know. Look at that wonderful fucking creature. Holy shit. <laughs> That's nasty. That's not nice. This guy's got that chiseled look, you know what I'm saying? Like, he, look, he looks fucking, he looks cool. The, the real princess, and she, uh... She's looking a bit rough, for the sake. Look at that wonderful creature. Holy shit. I saw that coming towards me in the street. Again, as with many rare creatures, I would go fucking funny. Kill the other in case someone gets knocked into him. Okay. Sweet. Not ready. So, like, there must be like a knockback is what I'm gonna say. But yeah, like with many wild creatures, if I saw one of these fuckers coming at me down the street, would not run towards its swinging swords thinking, you know, far to emperor and all that shit, I would be I would be going the opposite direction, going, best of luck lads. For the light and all that crack. Gone. <laughs> Fuck this. Right. Let me see. Same quick bio break. Okay, the lads are gonna have a quick fucking piss pop break here now. This magnificent fuck look at it in shoes, man. They look painful. That does not look pleasant to walk around on at all. Ugh, oh, stretch, 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 stretch. What a It's just water, no protein. Not yet. I exercise after this shit, then protein. This may be a fortuitously quite short fucking run of this dungeon, so um, this may actually work out in our favor because then the episode will still be in and around half an hour long because we're just hitting kind of a half an hour now. So I'm actually kind of happy with that. I'll fly back to fucking Ishara. Fucking stretch, man. Holy shit. I foam rolled while we were paused, by the way, while I was flying. So I've already loosened myself up. So I'm going to go straight to the fucking gym after this and work out. I'll come back and then later, depending on what time I get back at, I may do another episode. We'll see. We'll see. See how it goes. We'll see how it goes. We'll go from there. And then when I record that episode, I'll probably start uploading then. Because uh, I've got shit I need to work on, so like I won't be gaming. Burp. This could be a good time to, like, alt-tab out and figure out stuff about, you know, fucking Princess Theradris, but fucking, um... 
I reckon we just figure this shit out as we go along. Hunter is playing a dangerous game. Mm. Okay, one of them's back. Oh, both of them are back. All right, fucking Schwifty. Let's rock this shit. Let's smash this bitch up. Let's fucking say rude things to her face and cause her upset. Let's fucking jab her with pointy things. That sounds really like something you can miss this room. Right, let's fucking go. Give me ham. Ability didn't work for some reason. Stuff is happening. Oh shit. The tank is running away. I'm running away. I gotta jump, don't I? I remember this now. Ah, oh, it's coming back to me. You have to jump. Oh, jump. 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 Uh, running away. Jesus, fuck. Right. This is hard. Pop a pod anyway. Make life easy on that healer. Oh my god, man. Really? I haven't even got, like, throwing knives to get in on this shit. That's what I wanted range DPS. I understand now. Fuck my life. Holy shit. It's not about jumping. This is... This is horrific. Oh, I popped sprint and everything. I was just gonna go ham for it. Oh my god. No, no, no. Not like this. Not like this. I'm gonna back the fuck up and use a bandage. Oh, she's fucking coming in hot. That isn't ready yet. I'm Get a bleed on her, maybe? It's too far away. I know I'm clicking. Everyone just fucking deal with it. Oh shit, can I like evade this? Oh, jump. Oh, I just fucking run away. Oh, we can run into this shit. It's fine. Oh. That doesn't appear to be hitting me here. This is the fucking scrappiest fight it's I've ever had in this fucking game. Oh shit, I'm gonna get down here. No, I won't live through this. Oh, jump, 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 jump. How long have I gotta wait for I can manage again? Like 25 seconds? I'm just gonna fucking stay away. Because fuck logic. Can I eat? Can I, like, vanish or something and then not die? This is the fucking scrappiest fight I've ever been involved in in my life. 10 seconds. Let's go. 10 seconds and I'm back in it to win it. If I don't go down, it, it's totally legit, I helped. I can bandage again. Yeah, just kite that shit. I understand why you need range DPS now. Right, I'm healed. Kind of. Oh shit, right, that guy went down. I suppose you could just kind of commit to it and fucking... Get a fucking bleed on. No, oh. We hit it like twice. Jesus, fuck. Knockdowns are fucking... I, I can't do shit for this, man. No. Oh. Oh. Go away. There is like fuck all I can do. And there's no point in me running in and just... Going doom. Oh, that hurt. If she does her thing, I'm gonna die. Yeah. Yeah, okay. No, I don't want to waste the fucking healer's mana. I need to be away while fucking he just dots the shit out of it. <laughs> this is fucking abysmal, man. Oh, I've got the aggro. Oof. Nailed it! Boom! All me, baby. All fucking me. That is a nice dagger for fucking casters. And that is a nice head for casters as well. We will greet both of those. And we have completed our fucking quest. Does this bitch drop anything that gives us like a fucking yoke? No, they do not. Sup, brah. You got any quests for me? Fuck it, we can abandon it if it's a waste of time, but fucking we'll, we'll go with that. Oh, they want to do another boss. Right, so apparently they want to do croc. Why the fuck not? I'm here. They are here. We're all here. I fucking carried them through this boss. It's only fair that I uh, I help them with the next one. You know what I'm saying? It's okay. It's okay. That was that was fucking hard, dude. Like fuck for bandages is all I'll say. Holy shit, that is definitely a rage DPS fight. Definitely a rage DPS fight. Absolutely carried through that shit. Holy fuck. I was mad, man. How the fuck are you meant to deal with that? I thought you could jump, or if you could. If the priest casts, like, levitate on you or something like that, I think you don't take the damage because it's, like, an earthy kind of attack. Where's the croc? He's, like, he floats around down here, does he not? 
cannot remember for the life of me where he just be. Oh well, they're going for it, so let's go for it. Coming in. Boom. Rot grip. Oh yeah, shit. Inbound. Where's the tank? Nailed it. It's too far away. The I fucking water mechanics. Oh. Can we am I engaged? I'm in! Let's do it! Having a fight with a crocodile that's fucking five times the size of me. Holy shit. Get ruptured, bitch. I'm not even gonna pop, there's no need to just the, the mobs actually incur that high of a level. We do a lot of damage to them, so. Leather? <laughs> Can we get lucky? Can we get lucky? Can we get lucky? They are nice. There's three people going in on them. The fucking hunter will probably go in on them too. Yeah, I fucking thought so. Fuck it. Go over them if you want, but come on. Ah, yes! Motherfucker! This is what made vanilla fun. When you got sweaty and you won items. Oh. Oh. Rather than having an heirloom item that just fucking leveled up. Feels good, man. Feels good, man. And we're gonna skin this bitch just to add insult to injury. Yeah, bitch. Thick leather. Mm hmm. Cheers, folks. He's gonna drown here in res. It's a solid plan. 25% damage, and then I'll just spirit res, and I'll fuck off. I'll leave this AFK, and then I'll, um. Fucking. Get the 10 minute debuff will fucking wear off by the time I get back. It, it's a hit monetarily, but a hit that I'm willing to accept for the sake of not having to fucking run my ass all the way back out of this ship. Okay, this has been Gibbo Air, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed watching this video, please leave a like down below. Possibly consider subscribing to the channel. If you have any comments, questions, concerns, or anything that happened in this video, leave it down below in the comment section. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Take your handy. Bye bye!